Okay, I'm going to try this again. I've made like seven videos in the last three days. I don't know what's going on, but for some reason my videos will not upload from my camera to my computer. I'm going to try again and see if this time hopefully will be the lucky time. Alright, um, Tuesday I started my liquid diet for MedFast shakes during the day and at night a lean and green dinner. So today's day three. It was a little rough the first two days, but today I've found that it's much easier. The shakes don't taste bad, but it's just the transition from three meals or two meals a day to four shakes and then a meal at the nighttime. It's a little rough, but it's all worth it in the end. I'm getting through it and couldn't be happier. I lost two pounds last week. I know that doesn't sound like a lot, but that was two pounds before I started my liquid diet. So all on my own, not even trying. I was sick last week. I didn't work out or anything. So I was happy to hear that. Hopefully I'll have a bigger number to report on Tuesday when I weigh in to get my second week of MedFast. Um, I seen the pulmonologist on Thursday. He did some airway tests and he scheduled me for a sleep apnea test on August 12th. So on August 12th I have to go sleep at the hospital to see if I have sleep apnea or any breathing problems while I'm sleeping. Um, my next appointments will be Wednesday the 8th. I have three that day. I meet with my EKG, or meet with my cardiologist for an EKG. I meet with my nutritionist. I also meet with my physical trainer, which is for to do a tour of the wellness center, which is the gym on campus, which they let us use for two weeks free after our surgery. So that's cool. Um, I'm already going to water aerobics class there every Tuesday night, which is awesome because I get to meet a lot of post-ops who've done amazing and I can talk to them. Um, I want to say congratulations to Sarah. You finally got a date. That's awesome, girl. Um, Stan, congratulations. You're doing awesome post-op. Erica, you had your surgery. So happy to see that everything went well. I know you were scared about that. Monica, 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 118 pounds in four months and one week. That's amazing. That's awesome. Completely shocked to see that reported. You look awesome. Congratulations. Um, hmm. I had a million questions, but like I said, I've done the video so many times I forgot. Been out buying little things here and there for post op. I can't wait to make my what I bought video, but I'm not going to make it until I'm completely done. But I have found a lot of cool stuff so far and not expensive at all. I've even found a lot of it at the dollar store, Walmart, Target, so nothing major. Um, hmm. I really don't know what else to say. I had a whole video and I forget. Oh, yeah, yeah, my weight. I decided I'm not going to tell my weight right now. What I'm going to do is, for those of you who follow my channel, I am going to announce my weight on my surgery day. That's right, on my surgery day. On my surgery day, I will announce what I weighed when I went to the hospital that morning. I will also announce what I weighed when I started these videos a month ago. So, if you want to know what I weigh, you have to wait till surgery day. It's only nine more weeks in... I will announce it in nine weeks on my surgery day. Can't wait. And then after that, I'll obviously announce it weekly. I'm not going to be shy about it. And when you hear, that'll be when my husband finds out for the first time, too. Bad, I know, but it's not something I like discussing. You girls out there know what I mean. So I am going to let y'all go for now. I promise another video update on Wednesday. I hope this one goes through, but if not, it might be a few days late. But I just want to let you guys know that I'm thinking of you. I'm watching all your updates, and I am trying to update for you. I will talk to you guys soon. Bye.